His Excellency Emmanuel Macron, President of the Republic of France, Heads of State and Government, Mr. Lamain, President of the Paris Peace Forum, Delegates, Excellencies, Ladies and Gentlemen. I'm pleased to be invited by President Macron to address this all-important global forum. The Paris Peace Conference presents a unique opportunity for stakeholders from around the world to gather and discuss emerging threats and forge stronger bonds in international cooperation. This year's meeting comes at a challenging time for us all when we face a global health crisis. The COVID-19 pandemic has taken the lives of hundreds of thousands around the world and affected millions. The disease continues to cause havoc on the economies of many nations, Liberia being no exception. Although it appears we are watering the storms COVID-19 could have posed to our small country, thanks to early intervention measures by my government with support from the World Health Organizations and others' partners. The crisis came at a time when we were trying to resuscitate our economy. The lockdown measures negatively impacted those efforts, but the national development agenda has not been derailed. The pandemic has changed our way of life, but it has also given us more reasons to continue our efforts in order to meet global challenges. It was only through such collaborations as nations that we can defeat any pandemic. The time is therefore now that we come together as multilateral partners to contain COVID-19. Unless and until we mobilize our collective resources for actions against this unseen enemy, our citizens will continue to suffer from COVID-19. Together, as one world and one humanity, we will overall prevail. I thank you.